this year will be Sienna Hoster's first year at RHS Chelsea. An absolute pinnacle in the horticultural calendar and something that all the team here have been working tirelessly for for so many years. I'm stood in the centre of one of our show tunnels. In this tunnel here, we have over 1,200 varieties of hostas, all specimen plants. So we look through these plants and decide which ones we're going to use. With RHS Chelsea later this year, it's going to be a real challenge for us to decide which plants are going to look their very best for the show. For our Chelsea display, we're going to need at least 70 of these plants here all different shapes and sizes and all different growth rates which is particularly challenging so we're going to have to pick the plants closer to the time to see what's looking best for example this designer jeans looks lovely right now almost in full leaf but by september it, it won't look so good this year with rhs chelsea in september we have the specific challenge of bringing plants looking right for that show so late in the year so for example at the moment we've got a sago here next to a barbaran you can see how very very different they are in their growth rates and the way they come out so we'll be looking at plants that are coming out later to make them look good for the show our display will look quite organic and natural with a real emphasis on displaying the plants whilst also protecting them we really want to try and make it something that you can replicate at home Here at our nursery in Middleton, we've been growing plants since 1975 and salvias is our speciality. What colour lips would you prefer? In salvias we have a variety of colours. You can go amethyst, you can go cherry, you can go pink or you can go for the ever popular hot lips. Hi, I'm Chris Ashcroft from Ashcroft's Perennials and Ornamental Grasses. And this year, for the first time, we'll be exhibiting at Chelsea Flower Show. We're taking a prairie style display of ornamental grasses to Chelsea this year, which is being held in September the perfect time to show off grasses at their very best. The cool season grasses that have been flowering all summer are just moving into their autumn colours and the warm season grasses like Miscanthus, Panicums, Sorgastrums which you won't usually see at Chelsea are in full flower. Hello, I'm Julia Mitchell and my husband Adam Mitchell is behind the camera and we're from Green Jam Nurseries in Worcestershire. We had hoped to exhibit at Chelsea in the spring of 2022 once we've moved to our new site near the Morgan Hill that people can see in the background. But I have to admit the opportunity of doing a September Chelsea was too good to miss. Our Pensterman flower, or Pensterman which is our specialist, flower um, beautifully in the autumn and the idea of being able to put on an exhibit when they're in full flower is just amazing and we are really looking forward to it. We've exhibited at many shows over the last five years, mainly RHS ones. Um, and what our general ethos is for our stand is to try and create a small snippet of the garden. And we're going to have over 50 different varieties of pensamen on our stand at Chelsea. Um, but actually the bottom two thirds of a pensamen is quite dull, or at least I think it is, a little bit green. And so therefore by combining them with other perennials, it really enhances their flower colour and also gives a lot more interest in, in our exhibit and hopefully give some plant combinations that people can actually use in their own garden. We propagate and grow almost all of the pentamen that we sell. Um, in here, this is in our propagation house. We've got quite a few pentamen seedlings in here of the species. Um, we also do our own cuttings, and then these are potted on into liners. And we also propagate all of our own um, perennials, pretty much, and they are either done from seed, or by division, or again by cuttings. We now grow over 200 different varieties of pentamen and some will definitely be included on the stand at Chelsea. will be from the Pension series and also some of the Ron Sigwell Bird series which I absolutely love. This past week I've been potting large pentamen that are our stock plants that are also sometimes used at shows. 
We also have a dedicated show plant area that where we keep plants that specifically that we're going to use on exhibits where we can nurture them. And this is still being developed at the moment. Our exhibit in the Grand Pavilion is actually on a background site and we're hoping that we can use some of this weathered timber on a, as a backdrop on the stand to the garden to look like an old barn. My husband and I are going to be building the stand together. Unfortunately, he's an ex-hairdresser, which means his attention to detail is really good. And also he's quite good at following instructions as well. We're really excited about coming to the JLC for the first time. Um, getting ready this summer on our own site is just going to be amazing. And then coming to the show, building the exhibit and soaking it all up. We can't wait and fingers crossed.